see me, it's your girl, like girl, and we're back, 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 back. So as you can see, happy new year to you guys. I'm going to be doing a night routine. Yeah, so you know, get your little drink on because I was thirsty. You know how I go. You know, you know what's going on. So now I'm just going to run the water because that should be cool. So I was running the water for like probably 10 minutes. So it can get hot, steamy, yeah, steamy, hot, steamy, yeah, steamy. All right, then. After that, hop in the shower, as you can see. Just making a bunch of noise in the shower. I spent at least 45 to an hour in the shower. So normally what I do when I hop in the shower, I just wet my body for at least 10 to 15 minutes. Just with plain water. I don't really put no soap on me or anything. I just wet my body for at least 10 to 15 minutes. So after my body has already been emerged in water, I use Dr. Bronner's Pure Castor Oil Soap. I don't really use this a lot because I have chiffon clouds. I don't know if you guys know what that is. That's like these dark spots on your body. So I don't really use Dr. Bronner's a lot. I don't overkill it. So I just use it just in moderation. You understand? Like if I go out somewhere and it's a lot of bacteria, then I'd beat off with that. But I do not normally use Dr. Bronner's. But it's 10 out of 10. So then I bathe in Dr. Barnes for at least 10 minutes and I like scrub underneath my arm. Like I dig underneath my arm because I just don't like dark armpits. So I be digging underneath my arm. So I just scrub for a little while and afterwards I would like rinse off with hot, 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 hot water. So after I'm done rinsing off, I go in with my... Nazarol, I don't know if that's how I pronounce it. Nazarol shampoo. Like I told y'all, I have shipping clouds. So this the only thing that helps my shipping clouds. Like just get my skin to one color because the medicine what's inside the shampoo is like ketazol or something like that. What helps with dark spots. So this does the trick for me. So I scrub this into my skin, mainly my neck and between my breasts because that's where I have shiver clouds. I don't have shiver clouds. Oh yeah, in the back of my neck. That's the only place I have shiver clouds. So like I scrub this into my neck and between my breast area and that's really it. Sometimes if like it's really, really hot and the shiver clouds start to spread to like my face, then I scrub my face with this also. So I go back in a second time with the Nazarro shampoo and I do the same process over. I repeat the same process. Scrub mainly between my breast and my neck. That's my main focus. And I do be digging these arms because like, no, I don't want no dark arms. Like, no, 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 no dark armpits. No, sir. No, 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 no. I just dig my armpits till I want to see blood. That's how serious I take this shit. Now I know y'all probably wondering, when the fuck do this girl wash her face? Don't worry, baby. I'm going to do that right now. I never use this in my life. I repeat, I never use this in my life. So this is going to be the first time I ever use this product and apply this on my face. So, you know, you had to give it a little smell check to see if it smelled pleasant to even be putting on my face. So I just rubbed this into my face probably for like, what, two minutes, a minute. And then afterwards, I just rinsed it off because, like, no, nah, no. Nah. I don't even know what this is about, but, yeah. So, at this point, my hair was just getting wet. Like, my cap was getting wet. Please, blind me. My hair ain't fixed. After I yuck off my cap, that was it. That was that. My hair ain't fixed. I repeat, my hair is not fixed. So, as you can see, I washing this thing off my face. I could you not. This thing was so gummy, like, it refused to come off my face. Like, I was literally scraping my face with my fingernails, and it was not coming off. I don't know. I just don't know. So now that shit finally come off my face, I go back in with the Dr. Bronner's, and that's what I just wash my face with. I don't really have a face, face, face routine. I mean, I do. I could probably show you something in the next video if you want it. So I just is wash my face with Dr. Bronner's and the water is be burning hot. When I mean burning hot, I feel like I in hell. The water is be skull hot. And I just wash my face in skull hot water. And then after I don't wash my face in like skull hot water, I just turn the water to cold, cold, cold. So it get cool down. That's how I just wash my face. Please don't wash the back of my head. 
Now I'm going to go in with the Dove soap, you know, the gentle exfoliating Dove soap. And I'm going to wash my face with that. And then, how long? I don't even know how long I wash my face with this. I just, just wash my face with it because it's gentle on the skin, you know. Calms it down from putting all them other stuff on it. I just, just use this as a calming solution to calm my face down after I done put so much things on it. So after all that, it's done. It's time to come out the top and dry off. I don't dry my skin to be dry, dry like desert. I just, just pop, pop, pop on the kitty cat and I just come out the top. That's really it. That's really all. So next, I come out the top. Y'all know I was thirsty in there. Because like I said, it's been there for like 45 to an hour. 45 minutes to an hour. So I was thirsty in there. So I had to drink something. Like I was, I was dehydrated. Next, we're going to go in with some Suave. You know, can't have no sour arms. You know, put on your deodorant. Rub it on for a little while. Then rub the next arm for a little while. Make sure it smells good. And then that's it. After that... We're going to use some baby magic. I just love baby magic because it just smells so divine. Like, it really smells good. So, I put, like, a lot <laughs> on my arms and my legs because I don't like to be dry. I like, like, I love to have a lot of moisture on my body because when I be dry, it feels if I start to stick to the bedroom sheets and I don't be on that run. So, yeah. So I took the pledge to put on my clothes off camera. You know, I give y'all some decency. Then we're going to use some Johnson's baby powder. I just put powder everywhere. But mainly, I just put powder on my kitty. I feel as if powders keep you cool. So that's why I just put it on my body when I go to sleep. I don't put it on no other time because, no. Oh, almost flash y'all. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Then I come in with my facial toner. Like the witch hazel. I don't know which flavor that is. I think it's cucumber. If I ain't correct. And I don't put too much. Two little drops and I just pat my face and that's it. Because I don't like to feel heavy in the night. No, I like to be loose like a goose. So, two little pops and that's me. And then I come in with my body spray by Vince Camito. I think that's how I pronounce it. I know you don't supposed to be using this when you go and sleep. But I just be extra because I just be thinking like, what if something happened to me while I sleep in? And I smell bad. You understand? So that's why I spray my body. And then I just use these gummy bears. Someone put me on these gummy bears. But y'all have to get some of these because this is where this really is grow my nails. I mean, I always had long nails. But this gummy bear really is grow shit. This is be growing my shit for true. Then I come and I brush my teeth with my oral B toothbrush. Personally, I think that. When you're brushing your teeth, if your teeth don't bleed while you're brushing your teeth, you ain't brushing it right. I could just be freaking out, but I feel as if when my gums bleeding or my teeth bleeding when I'm brushing it, that means I'm doing a good job. I really just be brushing my teeth long, but anyways, next, I just use this tongue scraper. This tongue scraper is really good too. It's like, it really is scrape all of the old food that's stuck to your tongue. It really does work. Sometimes if you scrape yourself hard, like it would cut your tongue. That's why I try not to do it too hard. But this is really work. This is 10 out of 10. So after I scrape my tongue, like I be scraping my ass, I go in with my grass mouth wash. And I jiggle this up in my mouth. By at least 45, two, two minutes, 45 seconds to a minute. It really burns. The burning sensation means it's working. So after done goggle this down and goggle goggle goggle, I spit this out. And there you have it, clean face, clean pom pom. Like, comment, subscribe, baby. Damn, Kelly.